Clint is with us in Indianapolis. Hi, Clint. How are you? Hi, Mr. Ramsey. Thank you for taking my call. Sure. What's up? Well, I was wondering if you could settle, settle a disagreement between my wife and I. Uh, about six years ago, um, our financial advisor advised us to start using a cash rewards credit card. It's not one with flight miles or anything like that. And uh, buy everything with that. And uh, we will get a check about once every quarter. And uh, my wife wants to go back to paying everything with cash and not using a credit card. We're very disciplined. We pay the credit card off every month. Um, so I, I think it's a pretty decent deal where we get cash back. Mm-hmm. What are your thoughts? Okay. Well, she, she tricked you. She Did led she? you into the cave where the bear li- lives and asked you to ask the bear if he was hungry. That was unfair. Uh-huh. <laughs> she knew the answer brother before she sent you to me so i'm gonna be nice okay (laughs) but here's the thing how old are you i am 60 okay well you're you're about my age i'm 57 okay i Uh remember and you do too green stamps at the grocery store do you remember green stamps sure oh yeah and um my mom would buy crap at the grocery store that she did not need so that she got more green stamps and that's how green stamp that. that's how green stamps worked and yep. what we have found is there's tons of studies uh, on the behavior of a credit card user and uh, there's a thing in credit card usage or in payment in the payments world called friction and uh, anything that you, they can do, for instance, Amazon Prime has low friction. You just push a button and stuff's delivered to your door. And you don't even realize or feel emotionally that you spent money. The other thing that they use in the payments world to increase the use of a payments vehicle, like a credit card, is uh, gamification, which is you get points or you get to win the game if you play. Airline miles, points like you got, green stamps in, uh, uh, in, back in our childhood are all gamification examples that direct and cause behaviors. Uh, they probably don't direct or cause them that much for you because you're a fairly disciplined person. Uh, uh-huh. But th- to, uh, to assume that they don't affect you at least 1% is absurd. They make money yeah. on you. They make money on you. Uh, we know the behavior, all the behavior. M- MIT did a study that shows that when people pay cash, they spend 12 to 18% less on average. I don't think you're spending 12 to 18% more. I think you're more disciplined than that. But I can sure. just about assure you, you're spending more than 1% more. And so uh, there's tons of documentation, tons of behavior analysis studies in this world that show that while you feel like you're making money on this, at the end of the week, when all is added up, you're losing. And you're not losing by much, not enough to make you go bankrupt, but you ask me to solve the argument, and I got tons of data and logical thinking skills that say that she wins the argument. (laughs) Sorry, brother. This is the Dave Ramsey Show. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest content and check out these other great clips from the show.